basically the moment that your cash flow or your passive income is coming uh, is, is, is greater than your expenses then you're out of the rat race eh? I want you to understand cash flow. Another thing that I want to ask you is please make sure that you get the book The Cash Flow Quadrant by Robert Kiyosaki. I think that is one of the most powerful books that has ever been written understanding, um, uh, helping, you, help, helping people understand cash flow. Let me just explain cash flow for you so that you will understand how actually Robert Kiyosaki uh, explains it. According to Robert Kiyosaki, there are four quadrants, or in other words, there are four ways in how to start generating money. You can start generating money as an employee. You can start generating money as a self-employed. You can start generating money as a business owner. You can start generating money as an investor. Okay? Most people start generating money over here. And this is all the money that they uh, uh, start generating. The problem over here is that your income capacity, it's already limited. Instantly, it's limited because, of course, you are not controlling your, in your income making capacity. When a lot of people say, well, you know, I'm going to start my own business, they think that they're going to go from this quadrant to this quadrant. Is that the case? Of course it isn't. What happens is that most people go from this quadrant to this quadrant. They become employed to self-employed. Now, what is the problem with this? People which are self-employed, have, have the problem that they have, an, the, the, income, the uh, income problem that they have is time. There's only 24 hours per day, and of course they're not going to be working the 24 hours or the, seven, or, or the seven days a week. And also what happens is that they become, they become uh, very, very vulnerable because if they, um, let's say if they cannot go to work, they're going to start not generating income. The difference between being self-employed and having a business is that they, they have a system. Basically, when you become a business owner, you create a system that's going to start generating money for you. Everything in business is a system. If you're an employee, you are the system. If you're self, uh, sorry, if you're an employee, you are part of the system. Sorry. If you're self-employed, you are the system. If you're a business owner, you own the system, and if you're an investor, you invest in the system. So it's very important to know that we can actually make money through several of the, of, the quadra, of the quadrants. For example, when I, uh, when I started understanding a little bit about financial, uh, uh, a little bit about more about financial education, one thing that I understood was I was only perceiving money here. Then I started working a little bit over here, and it was just, I was working a lot. And it was until I decided to come towards this direction that I started really uh, doing by far better. Does that make sense? Sure. Great. That's why, I mean, I just gave you in a nutshell what uh, Robert Kiyosaki uh, explains in his books. Another thing that you need to know is uh, financial education is so, it's not something that they really give you in school. Um, Robert Kiyosaki has a very, very nice way of explaining it. And the reason why I want to include it in this, uh, in this set of uh, videos is because for you to understand this information, it's really, really vital. Um, we're going to be talking very, fa very quickly about uh, financial statements. We will have here, for example, if you have never read uh, his book, this will be a financial statement. So he w we, will, we will have here income. What do you think this one will be? Expenses. Expenses, very good. And also, another part of a financial statement, this will be assets. And this will be liabilities. If you want to know where you're going to be in the, in the future, you basically have to see where is your cash flow pattern going. For example, I'm going to show you the cash flow pattern of the, of the adolescents or of the poor people. Basically, they get their income, right? Afterwards, they get their expenses, and then they have no money. This is, the, uh, this is the, the cash flow pattern of the teenagers, of the adolescents, or of the poor people, right? Now, I'm going, to I'm going to show you the cash flow pattern of the middle class. 
the middle class gets their income, right? And then, of course, they're very worried about what the Joneses are doing. So, of course, they start living beyond their means, and they start getting credit cards, and they start getting all sorts of things through credit. So, basically, with their income, they get some more liabilities. The liabilities create more expenses, and then the money comes out, right? Now, if, you, uh, if, you, if this is your um, cash flow pattern, what's going to happen is that within the years, uh, you don't need to be a nuclear scientist to figure out that within the years, you're going to still be middle class or poor throughout, the, uh, throughout your life. Now, let me show you what's the cash flow pattern of the wealthy. The wealthy, they get money. With this money, they purchase assets. And these assets can generate more income. And then afterwards, they start generating their expenses. Can you see the difference? <coughs> If you, if, you get to do, if you get to change your mentality, if you get to change your psychology to start uh, uh, thinking like this, you will be able to be more, uh, more wealthy uh, in, the, in the near future. Uh, very good. Now, another thing that I, I want you to understand is with the internet, one of the things that is absolutely fantastic is understanding multiple sources of income. Multiple sources of income previously, before the internet, it was a difficult thing. For example, in, uh, previously on the internet, one of the, uh, one of the sources of income that you could have with a lower investment was, for example, to have a, a chewing bowl, uh, a chewing gum machine in um, a chewing bowl machine in uh, somewhere in a mall, or to have one of those uh, coffee things that people had to pay those coin uh, machines or a laundromat. Or if you, wanted to, if you wanted to do a little bit of a bigger investment, you of course can purchase property and that was going to, that was going to generate cash flow. Now, through the internet, the great thing is you don't need too much of, an, too, too much of a, um, a big investment to start generating multiple sources of, of income, which means that you can be generating money from several sites. You could be running, for example, at the moment I am running between 20 and 25 sites, and not all of them bring me the, amount, the same amount of money, but some, some sites bring me $100, some bring me $200, some bring me $5,000. So, so if we actually start adding up, it's actually a big chunk of money that is coming back every single month cash flow wise. And this is very, very important for you to understand that through the internet, you will be able to create multiple uh, sources of income. And now what's even more interesting is that through these multiple sources of income, you can start also generating multiple revenue streams what does that mean? That not only you can have one website, and this website will be only generating money one way, one website can start generating money three, <coughs> five, six, ten different ways. And that is, that is one of the very, very important things that you need to have into uh, uh, consideration. Now, another of the things which is also very, very important is if you, this is, this is the magic of it. And this is what I want you to understand. If you know how to work out what we're going to be talking about throughout these videos, the, 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 the magic of this is you set it and you then forget it. Isn't that great? You work. You, the, most of the formulas for, for people is they work, they get paid. 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 My formula is you work, you get paid, 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 you get paid. Now, which of the two strategies of making money would you like? The first one or the second one? The second one. 